Hey, and welcome to another Retro Adventures. Um, so today we're here in Paris. We have come here basically just for a holiday, take a few days off work, to chill out, wind down, and to see the sights. We didn't plan to check out retro shops, but, you know, curiosity got the better of us, and so we looked online and we found a shop called Retro Game Shop. So we thought, why not go and check it out and see what kind of goodies it's got. Some of the stuff here I haven't even heard of. I didn't even know it existed. Limited edition Sonic Sega karaoke for the Dreamcast. Box Nezes that are immaculate mint condition. We've got something up here called a Multi Mega, which is a hybrid. It's a, it's a singular console for the Mega CD and the Mega Drive. Sega Saturn's kicking about, Mega Drives. Box Sega Saturn just chilling, just sitting there. I mean, it's just unbelievable. We've got Box Neo Geo CDs, we've got N64s, Box Mega Drives. Limited edition Fantasy Star online controller for the GameCube. Now this was literally only released for the GameCube. Because Fantasy Star came out on it, obviously the Dreamcast had a keyboard. This is like a mesh of a keyboard and a controller for the GameCube so you can play Fantasy Star online. When you think of like a real treasure trove of, of what you want, what you want to see, this is it. This is, it's all, there is, there's no order to it. It's just here, it's raw, you've got like shelves dedicated to Zelda. You could sit here all day and look through and find 100,000 different things. I mean, even some of the controllers down here. I, I've just never seen it. a GameCube controller that's a bright orange. A couple of boxed Shenmue's, which is always nice to see, especially now, you know, Shenmue 3 is coming out, which is great. We've got an American one and we've got a Japanese one. Now, the Japanese one down here is literally, it's mint. It's, it's super fresh and uh, it's 25 years. You know, 25 years for a mint condition. Shemu. This is all Mega Drive. I mean, you even got Marble Madness for the Mega Drive. I don't know, that doesn't sound exciting to you. This is like a big favourite of ours. Japanese Mega Drive games, great Dreamcast collection. Like, and probably my favourite is the fact that there's so many NES. There's such a huge NES selection. Basically, we're going to have a little look around. Probably spend half the day here and buy some cool stuff. One of the, the nicest things is that the owner just said that this is like, it's not even 50% of their stock, and this is his life, this is what he does every single day, and uh, that's why it's so popular here in France. I'm going, to, I'm going to start off by saying one thing. Um, I'm completely overwhelmed today now. I'm, I'm exhausted. Um, our, our kind of motto, uh, Retro Rose motto, is like that we, you know, we like to hunt, we like to search for retro games and like to give them a good home, to clean them up, like make sure they're going to the right people. And you, you know, the ultimate goal is to find that place, that special place that's like, like wading through kind of dirt to find gold. But when you find a place that is you're wading through gold to find diamonds, it, it completely overwhelms you. I mean, we were only in there for about an hour, and I'm exhausted. And the amount of things I saw, I wanted to get so many things that eventually, I was so confused, I, I didn't get anything. And I just had to say, look, okay, we're gonna go, and we're gonna come back tomorrow. Um, also, we spoke to the really nice lady in the store, the manager, and she said that the owner of the store, who's normally in every day, the one day we came, she, he wasn't there, so we've arranged to have an interview with him tomorrow. Yeah, we're gonna go tomorrow, we're going to sleep on it, we're going to decide exactly what we want, and we're going to come back hopefully with some really, really cool stuff. But I can't suggest a retro store more than that. I mean, it, there's always something to see. I mean, there's games everywhere. It's incredible. So, uh, yeah, we'll tune into the next video to find out more.